Santa arrives at the Y swimming pool, dressed to the nines. The jolly old elf is ready to take the plunge, ready to bring a smile to the faces of dozens of people. This is a first for the Y with an eye on the future. I actually got the idea from one of our other YMCAs. Uh, I spoke to them and they, they convinced me to do it. And I reached out to whoever I could and we're making it happen this year. Hopefully it will be an annual thing. Parents wait with anticipation for what's about to happen to their kids, ready to make memories that will last a lifetime. Uh, well, she's a swimmer, so we thought this would be a fun experience for her. She swims on a swim team, so we thought this would be a cute Christmas picture for her. Even with all this fun going on, safety always comes first. Uh, we just make sure uh, everybody's uh, comfortable with whatever they're doing, make sure there's nothing to get tangled up underneath with, and uh, we bring a couple extra safety divers along to make sure that if anything was to happen, we can help out in any way we can. This event is so unique, even a reporter from WLOX TV showed up to help document history in the making. So far, the theme is great. I'm trying to imagine when Santa's is actually in the water diving around, I can only imagine what that must look like. And so just the overall atmosphere and seeing how everything's going to go down with the students and Santa going in there together. For the children, getting wet with Santa is something special, the perfect early Christmas present. I like that it was underwater. I think it's better than the normal pictures. And did you tell them what you wanted for Christmas? Uh, not yet. Something like this brings out the kid in all of us, no matter what your age. This takes us back to our younger days. Even couples dived right in with Santa. For him, this is just another way to help light up the holidays. It makes me feel great to, to help out any way I can and put a smile on a child's face, especially around the Christmas holidays. Even the staff of Y lifeguards couldn't resist the lure of a watery snapshot with the big guy, something that will proudly be displayed on the wall for years to come. Doug Walker, reporting for our YMCA.